So if the classical sun salutations were easy for you, if, or if you're already familiar with them, then you maybe want to try the, the sun salutation B, which is a more um, advanced way of doing the sun salutations. It's not a better way or, you know, um, it's just, uh, it, it, it takes a bit more skill to do it. Um, so yeah, just try it out. Um, do it a couple of times, you know, in the morning or at the beginning of your practice. Um, doing the sun salutations is a good way to get warmed up, to get into your body, to get into your breath. I mean, you activate all of your muscles. Um, your heart rate is going up. So uh, if you do three rounds or maybe five or eight or ten or even more if you want, um, you know, afterwards, you after a few rounds, you'll you'll be warm, you're, you know, um, you'll start to sweat. So if there's one thing you want to do during the day, you know, if you don't have the time or if you don't feel like it, just do a few sun salutations. Yeah, it's an excellent way to start your day or start your practice. Well, guys, enjoy yourself and be safe. Sun salutation B. Inhale, your arms are coming up. Exhale, fold forward, straight spine, straight legs, pull your navel in and up, hands are on the floor, on your shape. Inhale, come halfway up, shoulders are back, crown the head moving forwards. Exhale, fold forward, pull your navel in and up, hands are on the floor, step back into your plank pose. So you press the floor away, make your body very active, pull your navel in and up, open the collarbones, exhale, bend through the elbows. Inhale, open up. Come up into your upwards facing dog. So your shoulders are moving back. Legs are very active. Exhale. Press yourself up. Pull your navel in and up and move into your downwards facing dog. From here, on your inhalation, you step your right leg forwards. And your back heel is in the floor. Inhale, come up. So you come all the way up. You press into the front foot. Bend through the front knee and everything is turned towards the front, towards the short side of the mat. So shoulders, hips, maybe step your back foot a little bit towards the front. If it's diff difficult for you to turn, to make the turn with your hips. Or maybe take the turn a little bit diagonally, so to the left, like so, right? If it hurts in your hips or some, for some other reason. You inhale here, open up the chest, look up, exhale, fold forwards, hands on the floor. Inhale, look up, exhale, step it back into your plank pose. So pull your navel in and up, heels are back, open up the collarbones, exhale, bend through the elbows. Inhale, upwards facing dog. Exhale, pull your navel in and up, downwards facing dog. We go to the other side. So your left foot is moving towards the front or your inhalation. Back heel is in the floor. You press into your front foot. Inhale, come up. Warrior one. Maybe turn your hips a bit towards the right so that you're more diagonally. Or step your back foot a little bit towards the front. If it's this difficult for you to turn your head, hips all the way towards the front, right? Inhale here, open up the chest. Exhale, fold forwards, hands on the floor. Inhale, look up. Exhale, step it back into your plank pose. Bend through the elbows. Inhale, upwards facing dog. Exhale, downwards facing dog. Inhale here, upwards facing dog. Exhale, bend through the elbows, look in between your hands, and, on your, and then you jump or step forward. Inhale, come up, come halfway up, make a flat back, exhale, fold forwards. Inhale, come all the way up, straight legs, straight spine. Exhale, hands in front of your heart. 